Hello everyone, this is Kerry Anderson. Hope you all doing well. In today's video, I'll talk about why some women gain weight around menopause review. So if you like the video related to Turtle Hill, I would like to request you all please to subscribe the channel, hit the bell icon or give thumbs up so that I will come up with more and more videos with lots and lots of information. So here we begin. Let's go. Weight gain at menopause is very common. There are many factors at play, including hormones, aging, lifestyle, genetics. However, the process of menopause is highly individual. It varies from woman to woman. This video explores why some women gain weight during and after menopause. The female reproductive life cycle, there are four periods of hormonal changes that occur during a woman's life. These include premenopause, perimenopause, menopause menopause postmenopause premenopause premenopause is a term for a woman reproductive life while she is fertile it begins at puberty starting with the first menstrual period and ending with the last this waste lasts for approximately 30 to 40 years now i'll talk about the perimenopause perimenopause literally means around menopause during this time estrogen levels become erratic and progesterone levels decline a woman may start perimenopause any time between her mid 30s and early 50s but this transition typically occur in her 40s and last 4 to 11 years symptoms of perimenopause include hot flashes and heat intolerance sleep disturbances menstrual cycle changes headache mood changes such as irritability depression anxiety weight gain now third i'll be talking about the menopause menopause officially occur once a woman has not had a menstrual period for 12 months the average age of menopause is 51 year up until then she is considered perimenopausal Many women experience their worst symptoms during perimenopause, but others find that their symptoms intensify in the first year or two after menopause. Now I'll be talking about the postmenopause. Postmenopause begins immediately after a woman has gone 12 months without a period. The terms menopause and postmenopause are often used interchangeably. However, there are some hormonal and physical changes that may continue to occur after menopause. How changes in hormones affect metabolism? During perimenopause, progesterone levels decline slowly and steadily, while estrogen levels fluctuate greatly from day to day and even within the same day. In the early part of perimenopause, the ovaries often produce extremely high amount of estrogen. This is due to impaired feedback signals between the ovaries, hypothalamus, and P23 gland. Later in perimenopause, when menstrual cycle become more irregular, the ovaries produce very little estrogen. They produce even less during menopause. Some studies suggest that high estrogen levels may promote fat gain. This is because high estrogen levels are associated with weight gain and higher body fat during the reproductive years. From puberty until perimenopause, women tend to store fat in their hips and thighs as subcutaneous fat. Although it can be hard to lose, this type of fat doesn't increase decreased risk very much. However, during menopause, low estrogen level promote fat storage in the belly area as visceral fat, which is linked to insulin resistance, type 2 diabetes, heart disease, and other health problems. Weight changes during perimenopause. It estimated that women gain about 2 to 5 pounds, 1 to 2 kilos during the perimenopausal transition. However, some gain more weight. This appears to be particularly true for women who are already overweight or have obesity. Weight gain may also occur as part of aging regardless of hormone changes. Researchers looked at weight and hormone changes in women ages 40 to 50 over a three-year period. There was no difference in average weight gain between those who continued to have normal cycles and those who entered menopause. 
The study of women's health across the nation span is a large observational study that has followed middle-aged women throughout perimenopause. During the study, women gained belly fat and lost muscle mass. Another factor contributing to weight gain is perimenopause, maybe the increased appetite and calorie intake that occurs in response to hormonal changes. In one study, level of the hunger hormone ghrelin were found to be significantly higher among perimenopausal women compared to premenopausal and postmenopausal women. The low estrogen level in the large or late stages of menopause may also impair the function of leptin and neuropeptide Y, hormones that control fullness and appetite. Therefore, women in the late stages of perimenopause who have low estrogen level may be driven to eat more calories. Progesterone effect on weight during the menopausal transition haven't been studied as much. So that's all about the weight loss in the menopause. I hope you all liked it. For all of you, I prepared a small presentation that will be going to share in the descri description box below. You can check it out from there. So that's all. Before signing off, I would like to request you, please do like, share, subscribe with your loved ones so that they will get to know better. And this is Kerry Anderson signing off. We will definitely meet in the next video with my other content. Till then, God bless you. Bye-bye and take care.